Okay, so the moment of truth. Can I get train stimulated to work? I had the discs here, and what I did was I created an ISO image of them, then sent them to JK18. He then copied them and burned them into the computer. Yeah, for some reason, even though he did full install, he kept saying like wrong disk installed. So we'll see what works with the right disk. Please insert the correct CD-ROM, select OK, and restart application. So that's the error he was getting. So even though he burned the disks from the images I sent him, it still gave him that message. So we'll try it with one of the original CDs, just in case it's copyrighted. If it doesn't work with this, I'll delete the images I sent him on here, and I'll reinstall it directly from the disks, and go from there. It's running. Play. Please insert the correct CD-ROM. Cannot locate the disk. Okay. He want to be a bitch? Fine, I'll delete it and, re and reinstall it. Alright, so I'm in the process of reinstalling it. I uninstalled it and then restarted the computer. And I'm installing it directly off the right disks. That's in case it was copyrighted. If it still says need disk, then I don't know what to fucking do. But it's supposed to work with XP because that's what the thing says. So, it's installing right now. Come back in a bit. Still installing on disks 2 right now. Hopefully it works. Alright, it's been reinstalled. Will it work or no? Doesn't, this is the problem. Why doesn't it want to read the disc? Why is it being a bitch? Does a bootleg game to begin with? They sell me a bootleg game or what? The fucking problem. Dumb cunts. Doesn't want to work. Game probably bootleg. Nope, still doesn't want to work. So it didn't want to work. This is what I did. There's a third disc. I didn't give this to JK18 because this disc is technically not part of the game. The game is supposed to work with those two discs. So the fact now that it's making me install this means the time this isn't an authentic game. There's probably a bootleg, and then that's why they got you this. Because it's supposed to work with XP. So the fact that I gotta do this patch disc with an XP machine is telling me that this game is probably not it's probably a bootleg game. So I have to go on eBay and try to find the original actual authentic game. This is too complicated to uh, email the J all the steps this guy go through. It's supposed to be a Windows 7 patch to make it work with Windows 7. So why am I using it with XP? That's telling me this this game is probably not real. So anyway, will it work or no? I used this patch in Windows 7 and the game kept crashing. So will it work fine in XP or not? So we got this far. 
Let me play around with it and I'll come back with it with some updates. Well, it's been about an hour, it's still running. Let's see if it crashes at all. Approaching Baltimore right now. Microsoft will probably have a fit that I'm showing screenshots of it. We're approaching Washington. An hour and 25 minutes so far. The clock said 10 when I started. That's known as uh, cab signals. Trains above certain speeds have to have these.
there's the train. And that's that. So the game appears to work. Run smoothly. Couple spots where it'll, it'll like attempt to freeze, then it'll work again. A little jerky in a couple spots here and there. But it's going to be expected. So, it works. That's the main thing. And now we're back to the home screen. So, it works. Finally. Pain in the ass. <laughs>